This morning we are joined once again by some of our local Girl Scouts and also a parent to uh, give us the details of this cookie magic, wonder, wonderful event that goes on every year. And it does a lot for the Girl Scout program, but it also does a lot for the community, doesn't it? Because they get to try some really fun recipes that have to do with the cookies. So I'm going to come over here actually and talk a little bit to you. You're one of the parents. Tell us a little bit about how that has been first and then we'll go right into the event. Well, this is our fourth year doing this it's our night of cookie magic and it's a fundraiser for the local Girl Scouts so the money will all stay here locally mm -hmm. it's held at tomorrow night Saturday night at the I guess that's two two nights away yeah I know it's um, at the close. pond um, student union building in the Wood River room mm -hmm. basically people we've got 20 restaurants some of the best restaurants in the community and they've been challenged to create a dessert using Girl Scout cookies. Oh, wow. And so they'll have their wares, their samples there. The fun, the public buys a ticket. Mm -hmm. uh, they can buy for $5 to get three tickets, and that gives them an able, lets them taste three samples of the desserts. For um, $20, they give 15 tickets. They can oh, sample wow. 15 of these different things, and then they vote on their favorites. So that's the event. It happens Saturday night. Um, we've got a great sorority at ISU that's helping sponsor it. Oh, great. And we're going to have some bands, some music there. We've got some baskets to auction off. So it's a it's a really great fundraiser, and the money stays here locally for our local girls and helps pay for these programs. That's neat. And people can come to the door and buy tickets there, Absolutely. but they can also get tickets from the Girl Scouts, they right? Can. They can. They can get tickets from the Girl Scouts, and they can buy them at the door. Okay, so you've been a Girl Scout uh, mom for how long? Gosh, I don't know. Six, seven years? Six, seven years? Yeah. What made you uh, get her into the program? What is it about Girl Scouts that you've enjoyed? Girl Scouts teaches girls to be independent and strong and confident, and that's exactly what we want from our girls. That's wonderful. So, it's a great program. All right, well, let's talk to some of the Girl Scouts. You have this program going on, and like your mom was saying, six years. Uh, tell us a little bit about what you're hoping to come out of this event. Um, it really funds our whole year because mm -hmm. cookie sales are good, but they go also to the National and the Silver Sage Council, which is the local council. And so not as much comes to our troops. Yeah. So this helps to pay for all of our camping trips and all of the activities we want to do during the year. So yesterday we asked some of the Girl Scouts about traveling and that seems to be a really fun part of Girl Scouts. What have you enjoyed the most about Girl Scouts? Um, most of it is oriented around the outdoors so mm -hmm. I have to say I like the rafting best. Okay. But this year we're hoping to take a more historical twist on it so we're going to try to fly to Georgia and see the birthplace oh. of our founder, Juliet Gordon Low. Oh, that's awesome. And have you enjoyed it too? Is that something yes. that you've enjoyed as the outdoors and yeah. things like that? Um, I think it was last year we went to Glacier. No, two years ago. Two years ago, we went to Glacier National Park, oh. and that was really fun. That's wonderful. You guys are doing a great job, and hopefully we can get a lot more of the community to your event. And right now, let's...